Hi, this is Asin. You are now watching Asin Math TV. Today, we would like to share how to integrate e to the power 2x times sine x times cos x with respect to x. To make the integration simple, I'm going to apply the trigonometric identity. Recall that sine 2x is equal to 2 times sine x times cos x, which means that sine x times cos x is equal to 1 over 2 sine 2x. This implies the integral can be also written as integrate 1 over 2 e to the power 2x times sine 2x with respect to x. And we can now integrate the function. In this video, we are going to apply the tabular method or more commonly known as the DI method. D stands for differentiation, I stands for integration. We can split the function into two functions, one explanation function, one trigonometric function. Regardless how many times we differentiate, none of the function will reach zero. So we can simply put 1 over 2 e to the power 2x under d while sine 2x under i. Let's differentiate. Differentiate exponential function, we should copy exactly the same. So e to the power 2x. Differentiate 2x, we obtain 2. So 2 times 1 over 2, we obtain 1. And next, let's integrate. So when we integrate sine function, we should obtain negative cos angle remain don't forget that we should differentiate this part when we differentiate 2x we should obtain 2 under the differentiation we should times so for integration we should reverse the process times become divide so 1 over 2 next repeat the process again so we should differentiate e to the 2x again so differentiate we obtain e to the 2x differentiate the power we have 2 integrate negative cos is negative sine so angle remain 2x differentiate 2x we have 2 so again 1 over 2 times 1 over 2 1 over 4 since we obtain exactly the same form of functions as the first row so as we can see we have e to the power 2x under d sine 2x under i so basically we can stop here and join the function so what we have to do here is to take 1 over 2 times e to the power 2x times negative 1 over 2 cos 2x and the result is negative 1 over 4 e to the power 2x cos 2x next take e to the power 2x times negative 1 over 4 sine 2x and the result negative 1 over 4 e to the power 2x sine 2x don't forget that under the di method the sign should be alternately plus minus plus which means that plus times minus we have minus minus times minus we have plus and the integral is now equal to minus 1 over 4 e to the power 2x cos 2x plus 1 over 4 e to x sine 2x don't forget none of the functions in the last row is equal to 0 which means that we have integral remain and we have plus times minus minus and we integrate 2 times 1 over 4 is 1 over 2 e 2x sine 2x and we integrate with respect to x let's rewrite the equation by moving all the integrals to the left so we have integrate e 2x times sine x cos x with respect to x minus move over becomes plus integrate 1 over 2 e 2x sine 2x is equal to 2 sine x cos x since we need in the form of sine x cos x so 2 times 1 over 2 cancel each other no more and we integrate with respect to x and this is equal to the remaining terms since we have common factor so we can factorize 1 over 4 e to the power 2x and we 
times negative cos 2x plus sine 2x. We don't have to add a constant at this moment since the integration is incomplete. Let's simplify. So we have 1 plus 1 is equal to 2. And we integrate it about 2x sine x times cos x with respect to x and this is equal to 1 over 4 times e about 2x times minus cos 2x plus sine 2x next we divide both sides by 2 and we should obtain integrate e about 2x sine x times cos x dx is equal to 1 over 4 divided by 2 is 1 over 8. e to the power 2x times negative cos 2x plus sine 2x. And remember to add the constant c since the integration is complete. Okay, that's all for this video. Thanks for watching. Hope you like this. See you.